so I should do with something different than we've ever done before um, we've always fed our cows behind our barn for years forever we never fed them anywhere else but we've had a lot of rain the last couple of days a storm system came through and probably got at least four inches of rain over the last two days so I really hate to feed them behind the barn because it's a bog hole and it's a lot of mud and water and that's not good for their feet and one calf that we had shut up for four weeks we just got her foot healed uh, she has some type of infection and we had to give her antibiotics um, subcutaneously which is under the skin and we had to treat her foot so don't really want her to stand in nasty mud and eat hay so actually trying something different for the first time we are actually feeding them behind or in front of the barn uh, this used to be the old goat pen and uh, used to have goats here when I was growing up years ago my granddaddy had them out here but I figured it's dry high ground so we're gonna try something different um, it's still nasty weather and even if the sun was out right now you still do not want to put cows in a wet muddy uh, bog hole it's just it's not good for them we've done it in the past we've always done it but it's just not a good practice so that's why we're going with the high ground hoping that by doing so um, it will help prevent any kind of infection or what they call hoof rot uh, which is something that you do not want to ever let your cows get because it does have to be treated with antibiotics and uh, medication so yeah so for a little educational video today uh, the, the point of this is if you can help it do not let your cows have to stand in nasty wet muddy conditions